Let me do the speedy Gonzalez thought. You guys let me know if I'm missing anything. Okay. In the last 20 years since Putin came into power, 23 years since Putin came into power, because in the 1990s, NATO, Western Europe were literally looting Russia for decade. Looting it. Looting it. Okay. When Putin came into power, it became obvious that, wait a second, Putin is a nationalist. He's going to do what is right for Russia. There was a color revolution. Let's do let's do a red. Well, let's do civil. Let's do let's do yellow. There was a color revolution in Georgia, attempted coup in Georgia. Okay. There was a coup in Ukraine. Okay. There was an attempted coup in Kazakhstan. Okay. There was uh, attempted coup in Belarus. Uh, in these countries here, the three countries up here, there's flipping flopping, right? There was an attempted coup in uh, Hungary, right? I believe it was an attempted coup in Hungary with uh, Orban, right? Attempted coup there. Okay. What else? What else? Uh, those are the ones I can remember. Those are the ones I can remember. Am I missing anything? Am I missing anything? Okay. Am I missing anything? Because if you look at this and you're Russia, you're going to go, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Right? Because this is Russia. Right? And from the looks of it, from the looks of it, and all of these were attempted coups against leaders that were pro-Russian, right? And they were all, to a certain degree, color revolutions. They all were CIA funded. They succeeded in overthrowing Ukraine with a coup. They failed in Belarus. They failed in Hungary. They failed in Georgia. And this was a hot war in Georgia, right? And they failed in Kazakhstan, right? So, as the saying goes, or as the saying was going, right, in Iran, when all that push in the mid-2000s, all the hoo-ha that was going around regarding Iran, this is Iran, right? Here, let's put, let's put, this is Iran, and in the mid-2000s, U.S. had military bases here. Here, here, on the uh, Qatar, they still have it there. Iraq, okay. NATO here, okay. And they have uh, Oman. I don't know if they have a military base, but if you're looking at this, if you were looking at this, right? No brainer, right? You would go, oh, oh, oh. That's that's what you would think, right? Would you not? If I was in Iran, I'd go, damn. What? Why did we place our country in the middle of U.S. military bases? Well, why would we do that? How stupid of us to put our country right in the middle of U.S. military bases. Mm. Next time, we'll, we'll try to do better, right? Next time, we'll try to do better. This surrounding Russia looks pretty much the same, does it not? If we put the arrows in the right direction, right? If we put the arrows in the right direction, Russia. Georgia. No, oh, this was troll. I forgot to draw the arrow on Turkey going in too. Would it even look worse? Belarus, Ukraine, Hungary. You would sort of be going, what's going on? 
right? What's going on, right? Finland is trying to, uh, doctor, Finland is trying to join NATO. And from what I understand, the Finns don't really like the Russians too much. And don't forget, I believe, if I remember my history, if I remember my history, Finland sided with Nazi Germany, did it not? In World War II, Elder God, in World War II, was Finland in support of, uh, initially anyway, uh, the Germans? True. That's true, right? If I recall correctly. Right? They did, yes. Yeah. So here, should we put another arrow on Finland? There you go. And then there is Norway and Sweden. Like, we're not even counting. Like, do I have orange? I don't think I have orange. I don't have orange of these. So this is all really orange pushing this way, right? Like, literally. Like, what the fuck? Whoever that was here, do, do, did Russia do the right thing? Well, what the fuck? What would you do if this was you? You'd be sitting there just like Iranians saying, oh, how stupid of us. Why did we put our country in the middle of an attack going in this direction? Stupid of us. Right? We should have taken our country and put it somewhere else so we wouldn't have to be worried about NATO moving east. Right? How stupid of us.